Hello YouTube, this is Detroit Borg and I'm going to be unboxing the fourth generation iPod Touch. Now let's just take off this wrapper. Now if we just take a look around the box, we can see iPod Touch on the side, Apple logo on the top. And on the bottom we can see some of the model and serial number information. This is the 8 gigabyte model. This is available in a 32 and 64 gigabyte version as well. Now I see a little tab here indicating to me I have to peel this off to unseal it. I should be able just to open this up. I should just sit in here and you can pop this out. You can see it's on the little tray. And we're going to set this aside for now and see what's in the box. Designed by Apple in California. First thing we see is the literature. So we have the fingertips. And it looks like we have some of the standard warranty information. And of course, Apple stickers. And this time they gave us two. We do have a sync cable and some headphones. And once again, these are the headphones without the remote control and mic. Now to free the iPod itself, we just pull this tab. And it should slide right out. And we have a cover over the iPod itself. So we're going to peel that back. Now we can just take a look around right now. It's as clean as it will ever be. There is no oleophobic coating on this like there is on the iPhone 4. The back is that famous stainless steel shiny back plate. Of course on the bottom we can see the headphone jack along with the 30 pin dock and the little speaker port. Up here we do see the camera along with the microphone. And back here we have the sleep wake button. And on the side we have the volume controls. Of course, on the bottom we have the home key and the VGA FaceTime camera. So let's turn this on for the first time. Now, of course, in order to start using this, I do have to connect this to iTunes. Here I have my universal dock, and unfortunately, the touch doesn't come with a universal dock adapter, so we're just going to slide this on carefully. You should see iTunes appear. There we go, we're going to set up my new iPod. Now I have the option to restore this from a backup, but for right now I'm going to set this up as a new iPod. And I'm going to call it Michael's iPod Touch 4G. So here we have three generations or four generations of the iPod Touch, the first gen and the uh, second and third gen. The fourth generation Touch is probably its most significant revision since the first generation. The first generation and second and third generation had very similar displays. Of course the iPod Touch fourth gen now has the Retina display, a much higher resolution display which is borrowed from the iPhone 4. Now if we compare the thickness to the first second, third, and fourth generation, we can see that the fourth generation is quite a bit thinner. And in fact, you can see that the fourth generation actually has a very sharp edge. Now the first generation touch had this black bezel around it, while the uh, second and third generation went to this entirely unibody design with no bezel at all. And now the fourth generation does have this little bezel around it, similar to the iPhone 4. And you can kind of see it here. It's a, a like a plastic bezel. So the screen is actually raised slightly from the bezel itself, so it's actually a little more vulnerable unless you get a case to protect it. Now the fourth generation Touch appears to have lost the Wi-Fi window that was on the first, second, and third generation Touch, so I'm not sure how they got around that, but it may be part of the internal design. And of course they have added a camera and microphone. Now there was a built-in speaker in the second and third gen model, but it was internal and basically emanated from the dock connector itself. 
So here we can see the speaker itself with a little metal grate. So we can expect this speaker to be a little louder than the one that was built into the last generation model. So once again, guys, this is Detroit Borg with a quick unboxing and demo of the iPod Touch. You can expect much more in videos to come. Thanks for watching.